Hey guys, welcome to my channel. So today I'm gonna ride the bicycle in my new helmet. Uh, I'm gonna ride today Young Electric, but this is my new helmet. And I got it for different uh, e-bikes for high speed. So. And I'm gonna ride this bicycle. The Young Electric fat tire bike which uh, should have real nice performance as I test it a lot uh, in the mountains and it's uh, very torquey so let's go for a ride and um, I do this uh, 30 days challenge and let me see if I okay so I'm gonna ride with uh, my visor, so maybe it will be. A, I'm sorry, no visor, the shield. So I'm not sure if you can hear me well, but so today is a challenge, day number ten. So this is a bike number ten I rode so far. I'm gonna ride, I guess. And I rode so far nine bikes, and all of them different in previous videos. So starting every day I ride different e-bike and every day I'm gonna ride different e-bikes so that will create 30 e-bikes because I'm gonna ride for 30 days and so far I didn't miss any day and today I checking out the new uh, new helmet which is actually great and I think I need to turn on the light. Okay. Need to adjust a little bit maybe the light. Actually it's brighter than I thought. I, I thought I may need extra light but it's not as dark over here. So, yeah, I usually start with uh, bike information, the one I'm gonna ride today, and then we'll talk about the future stuff. And it looks like the same guy still here, but there is no bicycle. <laughs> okay. And I'm gonna try to make it shorter. And um, so, I'm riding the Young Electric. 750 watt motor 48 by 15 amp battery and it's a come with trigger shifting hydraulic brakes 26 by 4 inches tires I'll post a link in the description with a speed test and full video as well and I will show you Actually, this is one of the best performance up to uphill. I rode it like um, in steep hill as I test all the bicycles, and I think it was the fastest one. The top always here. And uh, I'm getting used to the helmet because uh, you need to break it in, and I just got it today. So I'm like I mean I work today first time like this. I did a video actually unboxing. I'm gonna publish on my desk channel tomorrow. I guess this video will be published after tomorrow because I skip one day publishing but I didn't skip any writing day. So it will be in I guess here yeah, tomorrow will be published the video for I guess today. Okay, so I like this bicycle. It has a great pedaling. And um, actually I like the helmet now. <laughs> I don't need to wear like uh, goggles or anything because it's protect my face from wind and it's much warmer. My ears are not getting cold. So I'm feeling like it really helps for me. I know it's a little bit heavier, but 
You must really feel it, I guess, right away. You need to get used to it. And it's a not a proof helmet. I bought it just because I'm gonna have some faster bikes, like gold bike. Even, GT, uh, even Ray GTX, also fast enough for regular hammer. So you need to have a dot approved for your safety. And I decided to get one. And it's not only looking cool, but it's give you a good protection. Also, this one comes with a face shield, which is great. And it can be converted to uh, motocross off-road riding as well or oh, bicycle riding off-road wherever like as long as it gives you good protection I'm all for that and I like the trigger shifting I wear the gloves actually it's for no design for the bicycle but they're fine uh, because the hands are getting cold usually and we'll have about 45, 50 degrees, it's like pretty warm for some, I think 45 outside. It's most likely very warm for someone, but for Southern California it's not as warm. <laughs> so this bicycle actually I have a really good deal on it. So if you're looking for bike, it's only like $900 with all my discounts on it. Otherwise like $1,500. Um, young electric and they give you like about up to five years of warranty limited so basically you got a good warranty I think like you need to read the website there's um, one or two years warranty on the parts and so and five years on the motor and frame um, I don't remember exactly so for uh, it's my actual second bicycle I ride today, but uh, I know like I want to follow my rules, the one I set it up that I will ride bicycle new every day. But if you want to follow the challenge, you don't have to ride every day new bicycle. You can just simply ride every day bicycle and post comments if you rode how long. And where you located, I'm sure like some areas so cold to ride, so I know it's kind of, but uh, if you get a good helmet, I guess it helps. I noticed like this one really, I didn't even close the ventilation, but it's protect, it's much warmer. So tomorrow <coughs> the next bicycle actually will be uh, goat bikes. Uh, it's a folding goat. I convert it to pedals. So it will have a pedals. So it's a folding goat which is discontinued model. But it is one bike, large folding with dual suspension and very powerful motor as well so don't miss it I will test it out I rode it only like once or twice uh, with pedals uh, only things on this bicycle I noticed it does come with a sporty seat but it's not it's inexpensive so you can change the seat for like 20 30 dollars nice comfortable seat if you need for long rides other than that this bicycle is very nice the button it's large over here it does come with manual bell uh, left side front throttle and i forgot if it's accelerate up to the top speed or only 20 miles but i think 20 miles only Let's check it out. Uh, 
And I think it's uh, depend on the federal assist level. Little amount now. And it's low. 74% the battery charged. Yeah, I didn't charge the battery since last time I rode it for a while, so I have 23 miles on it, so I didn't charge the battery. So it's uh, giving me only like 17% or 17 miles an hour. That's interesting. Is the battery or maybe just because 18 now. Maybe because it's cold outside. So that's maybe uh, reducing the power also the battery 74, 75%. But I think it was going about 20 miles from now. Hopefully the power dropped because it's colder maybe. So the throttle is not working as quick and not as uh, fast. Yeah, looks like it's cut off. Only 18. Then it's cut off. So maybe, and also maybe the tires. Uh, I didn't pump the tires. And I, let's see. Uh, last time I went for but it can okay now it's picked up when I start to pedal it. So, and uh, front tire got a uh, bolt head, but I never replaced anything and never put any slime inside to do it. And it's uh, not flat, so it's um, actually puncture resistant tires. I think it's scanned the tires. So it's um we have very really nice parts on this bicycle, and for 900 dollars it's a steel deal. They supposed to change the price after Black Friday, but I think they they just want to continue to keep it until they sell out. I believe they have like 12 of them. You had it before. I know many people bought them, but I'm not sure how many they have left actually. But if you're looking for good uh, fat tire bike, then this is a great uh, price. And it's uh, not only like um, a good power give you and stuff, but for this price you cannot find anything better for a new bicycle. And uh, so my new video, I'm working right now on my new video, as I, I did live stream today and um, I'm working on the new video about Mark Whale and then um, I'm waiting for the gold bike but I have like, I might um, start to do off-road riding uh, like so the video for the 30 days challenge will be mostly for off-road if I have time and depend on the bicycle I will ride so that should be fun I was thinking to ride this one off-road but I didn't have time enough today because I was recording Mark Web Tour Plus uh, very similar to this bike but uh, different a little bit setup handlebar this one is more like aggressive style that one is more adjustable nice bicycle the only things i didn't like it was mechanical brakes came with but they are very similar uh, i like the tail lights they have like nice set of tail lights which is great on this bicycle i think uh, you only get like reflector i believe and uh, maybe uh, i think they have like on battery i don't remember exactly so there's no tail light on this bike but the price are about $500 difference, which is not justified. So I think this one is way better deal. And 
again uh, quality both of them great and actually they are about the same torque power and this one is say class 3 and uh, mark wheel class 2 but i think based on the information depend what state because for california this bike is a uh, class 2 actually so depending on the state you live at so you may change the class i guess because this one going up, up to 20 miles an hour on throttle only and over 28 miles on pedal assist uh, i believe it was here maybe it, i don't remember exactly but over 28 and i'm just pedaling because i want to bike like exercise before going to bed so it's actually helping me to lose some weight not a lot but it will take some time and once i ride more i might go with um, just pedaling without power at all and i'll try to make short video so i guess it will be all for today thank you for watching coming below if you have any questions if you rode any bicycle uh, today or yesterday or if you're planning to ride tomorrow and welcome to join the challenge and i'll see you tomorrow bye